Johnny Depp, here's why Quentin Tarantino decided against using the actor in Pulp Fiction. At 59 years old, we no longer see Quentin Tarantino, a director, producer, set designer, and even a talented actor. It wouldn't be worth it to mention his incredible filmography, which includes timeless films like Reservoir Dogs, Kill Bill, Django Unchained, and more recently Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, but the case that interests us today is more specifically that of the 1994 gangster movie Pulp Fiction. A list of actors' names that the film director wanted to recruit, from the lead actors to the support cast, has recently been circulating online. Thus, Tarantino expressed himself on the subject. One name in particular caught our eye on the list in question, Johnny Depp. Tarantino refused to see the actor playing a role in his movie if the studio insisted on it. In the context of his podcast Two Bears, One Cave, Quentin Tarantino also addressed the issue that has garnered the most attention online, namely the mention of Johnny Depp's name despite though he did not appear in Pulp Fiction. The American director explains that he put this name on his list almost by accident in order to appease the production company, which pushed hard for Depp to appear in the casting. He wanted the future Jack Sparrow to play the part of Pumpkin, Ringo, who makes up a brawling couple with Yolanda's character. More specifically, Mike Medavoy, the president of TriStar Pictures, has insisted. However, Tarantino already had a very clear vision in his head for the part in question because Tim Roth was intended to play it. Because they had collaborated on Reservoir Dogs, the two men were already well known. In response to Medavoy's objections, Quentin Tarantino stated that he would think about accepting the role if both Roth and his backup choice, Christian Slater, declined. Finally, since Tim Roth agreed, the topic was not even posed. The director, who was still miffed by the circumstance, had in any case left the studio in place. You think that Johnny Depp playing the role of Pumpkin in this movie, who only appears in the opening and closing scenes, will add anything to the box office, simply because he plays the part, is that it? In actuality, Pulp Fiction didn't require Depp to succeed.